drum, the pulsating rhythms from West Africa that were transplanted to a new world and gave birth to the music of the Americas. Music that defines freedom, expression, and the search for truth. Jazz Roots, the groundbreaking performance series, explores the music that has touched the world. It all started in the fall of 2008 when a new concept was born. Create a major concert series that celebrates the music of the Americas, featuring award-winning artists at a world-class performing arts center. Miami's Adrian Arsch Center is attracting some of the best musicians worldwide. The Adrian Arsch Center for the Performing Arts of Miami-Dade County is proud to celebrate the fifth anniversary of its signature music series, Jazz Roots, presented by Total Bank. Let's step back in time to highlight the seasons. Season one. Legends of Jazz. Bossa Nova, the first 50 years. Tribute to Machito and Tito. Tribute to Ella and Basie. Roots of Fusion. Straight Ahead. Season two. The Blues. An Evening with Dave Grusin. Vocalese, jazz and soul. Tribute to Frank Sinatra. Piano Latino. Season three. American Songbook. Descarga. An evening with Keith Jarrett. Celebrating Miles. Three generations of divas. Guitar virtuosos. Season four, Jazz Meets Gershwin, Down in New Orleans, La Raza Latina, Blues and Soul, Jazz at Lincoln Center, and A Night in Rio. Jazz Roots in a few words, original and authentic. Jazz Roots, presented by Total Bank. A jewel in the crown of our signature series here at the Adrian Arsh Center. We've drawn an audience of over 50,000 people that have attended our Jazz Roots series over the first four seasons. But Jazz Roots is much more than a concert series. Miami's Adrian Arsh Center is helping hundreds of local teens foster their love of music while attracting some of the best musicians worldwide. It's an educational tool that teaches young people about our musical heritage and brings our community closer together. Johnny Ferguson and other high schools were very fortunate enough to go to the Jazz Roots concert and were even lucky enough to meet some very prominent jazz figures. In a partnership with Miami-Dade Schools, Jazz Roots has welcomed over 4,000 music students at no cost to our one-of-a-kind program. All students working with film composers, world musicians, it's just an amazing experience that they have, very real world. Students attend pre-performance sound checks, meet the artists, perform on stage, and learn what it takes to produce a large concert event. This is actually, it's beneficial to us because it helps us find out all the different roots about jazz, where we came from. It just helps us become better musicians. Larry Rosen is intently working to bring the South Florida community together with his jazz roots. Jazz Roots reaches out to all segments of the community. They get to see something that they probably have never heard, and they like it. We're so pleased to be part of this incredible program called Jazz Roots. I do not miss a Jazz Roots performance. It's that good. Jazz Roots, presented by Total Bank, celebrates its fifth anniversary with a lineup of concerts that will take your breath away. Right now, I'd like to sing for you a very wonderful oldie entitled Unforgettable. November 2nd, 2012, Unforgettable, tribute to Nat King Cole. What you are. 
for his identifiable and unique voice, a mixture of velvet and smoke, Nat King Cole is an American icon who transcended jazz and turned into an international pop star. George Benson, 10-time Grammy award-winning guitarist and legendary vocal stylist, pays homage to this iconic and unforgettable musician. L is for the way you look at... Joining George in tribute is international jazz favorite and pianist Freddie Cole, brother to Nat Cole, whose vocals are among the most respected in jazz today. And joining our all-star team for this evening is UM Frost School of Music's incomparable Henry Mancini Institute Orchestra. December 14th, 2012, Super Sax. Since 1928, when Johnny Hodges brought his gorgeous tone to Duke Ellington's orchestra, some of jazz's finest soloists have chosen the alto sax. The great Benny Carter, the genius of Charlie Parker, the hard bopping Sonny Stitt, the joyful playing of Jillian Cannonball Adderley, and the raw, bluesy sound of Hank Crawford. Maceo Parker, singer, sax star, and leader of the Godfather of Soul, James Brown's band. Gets you up to shake your booty. Candy Dulfer. This platinum selling artist made her name in the pop music world as a soloist for major stars such as Prince, Pink Floyd, Van Morrison, and Dave Stewart. Candy is ready to blow Miami audiences away. January 11th, 2013, Jazz and the Philharmonic. This special one-time event will, for the first time, bring together three major Miami-based arts organizations, the Adrian Arsch Center, UM Frost School of Music, and Young Arts, all in celebration of our Jazz Roots fifth anniversary. <laughs> In a search for the intersection of the world's greatest musical art forms, classical and jazz, we bring together today's greatest award-winning stars in both genres. Bobby McFerrin, virtuoso vocalist and conductor and 10-time Grammy winner will take center stage. He is joined by a host of world-class stars, Dave Grusin, Grammy and Oscar-winning pianist and composer, Terence Blanchard, young arts alumnus, artistic director of the Frost School of Music's Henry Mancini Institute, Grammy and Emmy award-winning composer and trumpet virtuoso, Mark O'Connor, Grammy-winning violinist, composer and educator, Eric Owens, Grammy winner, young arts alumnus, Metropolitan Opera bass baritone star, Shelley Berg, Dean of the Frost School of Music and award-winning pianist, the Henry Mancini Institute Orchestra, and additional jazz and classical stars to be announced soon. This will be a magical night to light up the city of Miami. February 15th, 2013, Monk and Coltrane. In celebration of Black History Month, Jazz Roots honors the legacy of two pillars of American jazz and culture, Thelonious Monk and John Coltrane. This epic evening will be headlined by T.S. Monk, critically acclaimed drummer and son of Thelonious Monk. When my father walked in, it was like a, a hush, you know, like everybody catch their breath, Monk's in the room, you see. It begins to tell around midnight. T.S. will be joined on stage by the supreme musicianship of the quintessential jazz vocalist Nina Freelon, a six-time Grammy nominee, and 1999 Downbeat Jazz Vocalist of the Year, Kevin Mahogany. 
Ernie Watts, two-time Grammy-winning saxophonist, and his quartet will take center stage to celebrate the Coltrane legacy. March 22nd, 2013, Cubop, celebrating Diz and Chano. The musical collaboration between bebop innovator Dizzy Gillespie, who became the godfather of Latin jazz in the U.S., and the great Cuban conguero, Chano Pozo, will be celebrated in this groundbreaking concert. Paquito de Rivera, renowned Cuban multi-instrumentalist, multi-Grammy awardee, and NEA jazz master will headline this event. John Faddis, Grammy winner, Dizzy Gillespie protege, leader of the Dizzy Gillespie alumni all-stars, will bring the Diz vibe to this special evening. Giovanni Hidalgo, Grammy awardee, will represent the legacy of the great Chano Pozo. Grammy Award winner Dave Samuels will bring his vibraphone virtuosity to the mix. And the FIU Jazz Big Band will rock the house as we honor Diz and Chano. April 12th, 2013, Jazz Appreciation Month, Generation Next, Piano. Jazz is a story of creative evolution. It started with ragtime pianist Scott Joplin, but exploded when pianists like Jelly Roll Morton added the swing component. Next, Art Tatum, Duke Ellington, Count Basie. The bebop age brought forth amazing stylists, Bud Powell. Oscar Peterson, Thelonious Monk, and Dave Brubeck. Contemporary pianists Herbie Hancock and Chick Corea changed the landscape. And today, a new generation of pianists keeps pushing the envelope and are bringing jazz piano to an exciting new level. Hiromi, Swing Journal Award winner. Jazz Life Gold Album of the Year. Downbeat, new artist of the year. Hiromi grew up in Japan, came to the US, and exploded on the jazz scene. She has recorded duets with jazz legend Chick Corea, and her albums are on the top of the Billboard Jazz Charts. Hiromi is taking the jazz world by storm. Gerald Clayton, multi-Grammy Award nominee, Young Arts Awardee, U.S. Presidential Scholar in the Arts. Downbeat Magazine Reader's Poll voted him top upcoming pianist. And now at the age of 26, Gerald is continuing to make music history. celebrates the music that has touched the world. Jazz Roots, a Larry Rosen jazz series. Jazz Roots is proudly presented by the Adrian Arst Center for the Performing Arts of Miami-Dade County.